Padushi Thashbadi an Indian model and actress born on 1989 was found dead in her apartment, in Mumbai, in October 2012. She was one of the dream girls who just stepped in the world filmy lights. Her dream was to become the most successful was trapped in the shadows of death, before start. Padushi Thashbadi had proved the glory of her bright future, when she stepped in the filmy world. She was second runner-up in the 2006, Miss Chennai, beauty pageant. She had appeared in a few Tamil films, including the 1006 crime thriller Vekte Yadu Vailyadu. The 23-year-old actress was found dead in her apartment on 22 October 2012. Badushi Thashbadi and Kede got married in 2009 and were staying in a rented flat in Manish Garden building since the past 18 months. Apparently her death, caused by excessive bleeding, is the subject of a murder investigation. Badushi Thashbadi, born in India, Adishka, she started her career as a model, and stepped in the Kollywood within a very short period. She was a model, an actor, and singer. She was cast in Vetayadu Vailyadu, a Tamil film with Kollywood actor Kamal Hussain. The film was a hit. In the same year, she was the second runner-up in Miss Chennai Beauty Contest. She was called by some nicknames that were Lychi, BD, Baidu. She was known in Kollywood as a good singer and dancer. After her movie, she was married to an IT professional Kedda Badi. However, after her movie she was moved into high debt. According to the forensic experts, Badushi Thashbadi death was a murder and not an accidental death. According to her husband's statement to the DN Nagar police, when he returned to home from office, he found Badushi Thashbadi lying in the passage of their ground floor apartment in a pool of blood, with shards of glass strewn around her body, and a showcase with broken glass panels on top of her hand. The autopsy report revealed that, Badushi had nail scratch marks across her face and neck, and a deep injury on her head. Based on the post-mortem report, the DN Nagar police registered a case of murder against unidentified persons. Based on the initial reports the police started investigations, during police investigation, the apartment watchman revealed that, a man arrived at the flat between 9 and 9.30 and left without making any entry in the visitor register. At exactly 2.14 the same day, another person arrived and entered his name as Frey. He knocked on Badushi's door, but did not get any response, after which he left. As usual the police also examined her mobile phone contacts and SMS from which the police started making another theory from some SMSs, the SMSs were about promises of roles, and seeking compromise in return. From these SMSs police suspected, that the killer might be a person related to the film industry. Based on the building watchman statement, the police tried to track down a person who allegedly came to the victim's flat between 9 and 9 past 30 on the fateful day. The police suspected that the person might have paid the second visit to victim house just to confirm her death. The mystery over the death of model Badushi deepened after an eyewitness claimed to have seen a stranger leaving the victim's flat on the day she died. According to her husband, Badushi often suffered spells of giddiness and passed out. He told the police another angle, that it was possible that Badushi fell over glass that pierced her body and caused her to bleed to death. The police also examined the CCTV footage of the colony, and interrogated the watchman again about the people who may have visited the premises. The forensic experts team had examined the spot where former Miss Chennai Badushi Thashbadi's body was found and said the crime scene showed that she was murdered. There were a number of reasons for ruling out an accidental death. 
The size, shape and depth of the injuries were such that they cannot be accidental in nature. They were too deep to be caused by an accident. The police investigated almost all angles of Miss Chennai case but found nothing. Despite many clues of murder the police called it an accidental death, and closed the case file after a long investigation. Kindly don't forget to like and subscribe our channel for more videos. Then you for watching this video.